Yo, what's going on, sexy similar squad? Today we're here doing a ranked 1v1, but not just any ranked 1v1. It's a tryhard Thursday. Uh, in this tryhard Thursday, what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna do an underrated, uh, underrated gods. <sighs> people that, or not people, but gods that, for some reason, people think aren't very great, but. In reality they're like s tier or just they're just very high up there they're very strong picks so that's what i'm gonna do game one is gonna be chiron i think people underestimate chiron a lot like it, it to be fair it is pretty easy to underestimate him it's easy to overlook what chiron can do just because of the fact that there's other hunters that do what Chiron does. Not exactly, but, you know, they're hunters. At the end of the day, if you have a long-range auto and it hits hard, you're pretty happy. But uh, the reason I think Chiron is super underrated is because of his passive. He has a, it gives him power, and it heals him. Um, when you have the stacks available, you get extra power. And when you have, uh, or when you use a stack, you gain healing from it. If you need the healing, that is. When I used my one just now, it didn't use a stack, but. Yeah, you can see when I use a stack, I'm getting power from it as well, so. You can really abuse that to do a lot of damage. If you mannequins instead of boombas, which is fantastic for me. If you went boombas, I would be a little bit more frightened. I am assuming you're coming here. You are. Oh, that is just not cool. I should be able to kill, though. Oh, if that auto hit, man. Oof. Damn. Sucks that I lost that buff. But whatever. It is what it is. I 50 50 it with my, uh, with my two. Basically knowing he was going to use his one and me knowing I'm going to use my two. I said, whatever. Good luck to both of us. I'm going <laughs> to just try my best here. Um, I'm assuming he's backing. If he's not, it's fine. I mean, I, I don't think I'm... I have kill opportunities on him here. He's level 5, so... He's got the good old Chrono Salt that everyone wants. In the back, though. Okay. I guess I won't back. Now I will back. He's going to be extremely greedy and try to stop my back again. For some unknown reason. I will never understand it. I will never understand it. But, you know, whatever. If that's what you want to do, that's what you want to do. I can't stop you. Alright. I got my chalice. He probably did not get his... Whatever it's called. Whatever the ring is called. Didn't. Not really much to see here. Just a, a man vibing. You're not gonna let me back, are you? I I hate. You. I actually hate you. You play so annoying. There's almost no mana left. Whoa, 
50 50 it again and it did not work out for me jesus he does a lot of damage Okay, he is just going to give me this. I guess because he knows he has no mana. Ah. Uh, mannequin's OP. Scared the back line. Did I not hit the front line with that one? I guess I didn't. All right, no big deal. What's the uh, gold count? I'm ahead in XP, but I'm behind in gold. Honestly, I'm okay with that. I am honestly okay with that. Got his ring of Heke going into Breastplate. I'm going to go... Well, I was going into Shogun's. He's doing Bull Demon, huh? Oh, no, he's just back. Weird back. This guy plays super greedy, man. It's actually kind of insane. Like, I thought I was greedy. This guy's another level. Alright. Shogun's is 1,500. Pretty far away from that. He spams his abilities so much, man. Like, just look at his mana. All the time, he has no mana. Why did he just back? <laughs> I'm just waiting, man. Like, I want to do stuff, but I don't know what to do here. Bro, he didn't even wait for his mana to come back when he backed. What was the point of it, then? The whole point of backing was to get your mana. Yeah, you saw me. use my uh, abilities here to grab some healing and it is a not insignificant amount of healing oh bummer I really want his red buff or his blue buff I mean why did the two not hit him when I hit him with my alt It might seem like I'm taking a lot of poke, but if you remember, I had 820 HP when he got there for red buff. And after spamming my abilities and just trying to get buffs, I'm back up to 1000 HP now. So you can definitely tell my passive is putting in some, some work. My passive is definitely putting in work. I have a lot of gold. But I don't know. I'm just not scared of him because he has no mana. He never has mana. Like, he has he has enough for one combo, and it's, it's not even enough to hurt me after he ults. You know what I mean? So, I don't see a point in being scared. All right, well, we got our Shoguns. We'll get here to uh, Xe. I could go Toxic Blade here. Because he does have Lifesteal. He does have a Chalice as well. Toxic Blade could help with that, but 
I'm gonna opt into Kins. I could go Xy too. Oh man, that attack speed feels so nice. Holy shit. From having no attack speed to having that much attack speed, that feels real good. Oh, it actually got the stun on me. doing a lot more damage than he is but it's still not even mattering because i don't have kins and i don't have xy so all damage i'm doing even though it is better than his it's not like crazy op you know like i'm not absolutely fragging him all of a sudden dude all this healing jesus see what i'm talking about now man I don't even have any life skill. Oh, almost fucked that one up. All right, cool. I think. He foregoed going for red because he wanted his blue so bad. No good at this. He definitely does want his blue. <laughs> that was nice. Gave him a, a little taste of his own medicine there. A little taste of annoyance that he's been trying to give me all game. Not really trying. To be honest, he has been annoying all game. <laughs> but I gave him a little piece back. All right. I got my kins going into Xy now, and then I'll go probably Toxic Blade. I could just go crit chance. Like, I, I could just go instead of Toxic Blade or getting any amount of anti-heal. I could just straight up. Uh... Oh, man, I do a lot more damage than you do. Holy crap. I could just straight up do. Uh... Oh, that hit. Ouch. And. Holy crap, look at that damage. There's his ult. And with that, I ult. Doofus. I really could kill him here. Uh, I do have my XE up, or I will, once I back. Grab that. Also, I will admit, I will admit, Aussie does look pretty nice here as well. He has no anti-heal, so with my passive chalice, and oh, never mind, he's going toxic blade now. Grabbing it. Oh, he actually went. That's surprising.
Nice. Nice. He did get his toxic blade online. He definitely has a lot more canceling out for sustain, and I have a lot more damage. Look at that DPS, man. Oh my god. I will have to beat this. Never mind. Mm, not enough to kill. But still, I mean, you're seeing the power here, right? This is a relatively meta build for a Kronos player. And I am just completely out damaging it this is my tower he's staying very far back Alright, time for my blue buff. My guess is he goes bull demon here. Oh, that is not good. I really thought that he would actually go bull demon. I was so incorrect. Uh, Mace, obviously good. Toxic Blade, obviously good. Aussie, less good. Fine. Let's go this. Mace is good, but... I don't know. The extra damage is good. I just feel maybe I don't need it. Because... It's not like I'm... It's not like the physical protection is going to help me at all. You know what I mean? Like, it's, it's going to do jack shit. All right. My guy is swinging like a maniac right now. Look at him go. Look at him go. It's a red buff. Thank you. percent going to have to alt this all right i don't know why he greeted that so hard i really do not i'm just spamming my passive getting my uh my healing going Go, minion. Perfect. Perfect stuff. Now, he still has... Uh, oh, my God. That was first blood. We're 19 minutes into the video. Jesus Christ. He did go mannequins, Mace. Kind of sucks for me because it's a lot better on him than it is on me. <laughs> but that's okay. That's all right. He got bull demon, and I'm the one that got the kill and the phoenix, so I'm feeling okay. I am nervous because if he pops out of a corner with his two up and starts smacking me, I don't think I win the auto trade. So I got to be a bit spooked. Okay. I've missed his thumb. You missed your stun, I'm chilling. Okay. Alright. 
pop some pots. Get my regen going. It is hard to push in. I will admit that. It does do a lot of damage. And look at my regen, though. I have no life steal. All of my regen is coming from pots and uh, my passive. Should be chilling here. He has no mana. Basically, I have to mess with him until he runs out of mana, and then I can win the game here. Oh, I died to tick damage. Oh my god, Mannequin Mace did 600 to me. Mannequin's Mace did so much damage to me. I feel like maybe I could go instead of uh <clears throat> what is this uh toxic blade i feel like instead of that because all he has for sustain is 12 percent lifesteal that's really not much so maybe i can go into something with pen like silver branch that might be better because i genuinely do not care about toxic blade if he only has 12 percent Life steal, all game. Silver Branch is gonna keep the same attack speed. It's gonna give me 30 power and 20% pen though. Obviously the passive of Silver Branch is not gonna work, but the base stats of Silver Branch are very good. Be good. The blue is up. I will be taking that after I get the Phoenix, of course. Wow, I saw an immediate difference. I, my first auto last time hit him for 101, and now it hit him for 160. I think. Maybe it was 150. Either way, it was a lot more. Hmm. Hasten ring. He wants to land an auto and go crazy aggressive. Might be circling around me. I don't see him. Also kind of want oboe. Kind of feeling like an oboe would be useful here. There you go. I see him there. I will shred this bull demon. Thank you, Mannequin's Mace. All right. This hastened ring is just chilling in effect, man. his alt. Well, that hasten ring is still up, huh? Hmm. This is quite an annoying game. Just getting to the end. Oh, man. That sucks. I think I lost the game off that. I got shell baited. He's so fast. Maybe I don't even need XE. Maybe I do it just go crit chance. Your middle tower has been destroyed. 
destroy. Maybe I do this. Your middle phoenix is under attack. Your middle oh, actually. phoenix is oh. Definitely feeling that attack speed reduction though. Definitely feeling the attack speed reduction. I think I just want to go wind demon. Like now 50 basic attack damage is massive. I can't get rid of that. What if I got rid of this? What if I go no defense and just double crit? It's risky. But it does bring my crit chance to 50%, so I should be chunking. Yeah, I definitely hit really fucking hard. Oh man, I really feel like I need an oboe now. God, he's so annoying. Okay, this dude's coming up. You ready to be aggressive again? There it is. gonna have to kill him i i can't compete with the amount of damage output he has okay that was really good got back to back crits and just shredded in there please okay Yeah, he's max attack speed. He is. He's literally 2.5. I think... I don't know. I definitely should have won that game. I did land four autos in a row with no crit at 50%, which is kind of shitty. Because if any... Like, literally, if a single one of those autos crit, I won the game. Oh well, is what it is. Um <clears throat> I guess I'll see you guys in game 2.